Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am Alinga Sise of Herb and Harvest Organic Farm. First of all, I want to thank you for clicking into this video. Uh, today I want us to look at something very important in poultry farming that I know most of you could have heard about it and some of you might have not and that is garlic in our poultry farm. Uh, garlic is one plant that most people have used it for many years in different ways. We have used it in the kitchen. Personally, I use it every day in my kitchen. People have used it in curing infections, in UTIs, in so many ways. So the same way people use it, we also use it in our poultry farms. And I'm much aware that most of you could have heard about some of the information about use of garlic in the poultry farm. Uh, but today, I want you to know that there are quite a number of medicinal plant, plants that we use in our farms. And uh, as a beginner or a farmer, if you can afford all of them, please use them. But if you cannot afford all of them, try to get what you can, what you can afford. Like for example, uh, plants like garlic, like for us back in our villages, uh, we, we, we do not know garlic. We only see garlic in, in town. So a farmer out there deep in the village, if you cannot afford garlic, you can use ginger, you can use charcoal, you can use aloe vera. You know, there are quite a number, but I don't want to dictate that please use all of them. Only that it, you can use all of them if you can, if you can afford them or if you can access them. But if you cannot access them, try to, <clears throat> try to see the ones you can, you can use, okay? So today I want us to talk about some of the benefits of garlic in our poultry farm, how I give garlic to these birds, and at what age are we supposed to start giving garlic to the, to the birds, and what quantity are we supposed to give these birds, this garlic. So please stay tuned till the end, and I will be grateful. So, as I told you earlier on today, I want us to look at some of the benefits of garlic in our poultry farm, how I give this garlic to the birds, and at what age are we supposed to give the, the birds the garlic, okay? Number one, the number one benefit of garlic that I know is that it boosts the immunity of our birds. If you give these birds garlic, they will be very strong, they will feed well, and they will rarely fall sick. So therefore, garlic is important in our poultry farm. Number two is that uh, garlic is also a natural insect repellent. It contains sulfur compound that repels pests like mites, like ticks, like fleas and lice in our, in our poultry farm. So therefore, it is good to give these birds garlic to avoid these pests from infesting our poultry farms. And number three that I know is that garlic also helps chicken in fighting diseases and infections so when you continue giving your birds garlic it will help them in fighting infections and fighting some of these diseases okay therefore it is important to use garlic in our poultry in our poultry farm another benefit is that garlic also helps in stimulating appetite in our chicken we all know that garlic has a very strong aroma which helps in stimulating the appetite this is especially among birds which are sick and has low appetite if you give them garlic in water or garlic in feeds they will really feed and they will get the appetite to feed okay so therefore i recommend everyone out there to use garlic in their poultry in their poultry farms another benefit of garlic that i know it is a source of nutrients like vitamin b6 and manganese which are essential for the health of our of our chicken therefore garlic is really very important in our poultry farm because as birds have these nutrients they will grow well and they will lay they will lay eggs they will lay well garlic also promotes egg production and meat production of course if birds are not sick if they have immunities their immunity is strong those birds will probably lay well and probably perform well even in broilers birds that broilers that take a lot of garlic always gain a lot of weight compared to broilers that are not given uh, that are not given garlic therefore garlic is really very important into in our in our poultry farm but what i know for over the years some people have given 
Some people have been saying garlic is not good, but research has proven that garlic, when given to birds, it will improve on their immunity, it will boost on their appetite, it will uh, make their egg production and meat production high, and therefore garlic still stands as one very important plant in our poultry, in our poultry farm. Uh, at what age do you start giving garlic to your, to your birds? Personally here, I normally start giving them garlic at, the, at five weeks. At five weeks old, I start giving them garlic. And how do I give this garlic to my birds? Me normally here, okay, some people do chop it into smaller particles. They just slice it like onions and give it to their birds. Some people mix in the feeds. But, but for me here, I just get the cloves of the garlic and put in the mortar, pound it. After pounding it, I put in the drinkers and add their water and then I give to my to my birds, okay? So that is how I give this garlic to my birds. I don't even sieve the I don't sieve the juice. I just put the way it is. After pounding it, I just put it the way it is in the in the drinkers, add their water, and I give to my to my birds. But one thing that I want you to know is that uh, if you're introducing this this med, this herbal this herbal plant to these birds, if it is their first time, always what you should do to make them drink the water, first withdraw the water for some time. First make them very thirsty and then later you introduce the 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 medicine that the herbal medicine that you want to do want to give them. Even the garlic, you know garlic that strong smell, the birds might not like it. So in the beginning what you do, you first withdraw all the drinking water, let them starve for some time, let them be thirsty for some time, then now you introduce, you introduce the water with garlic in it. The birds will really drink the water happily and in that way they will get used to it and to help and to serve the purpose that it is supposed to, it is supposed to serve. Well, uh, people might ask uh, that, um, what amount do you give this bird's garlic? Uh, normally me, I count one clove to one liter of, one liter of water. So if the, 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 the drinker is 10 liters, I put 10 cloves in the what? In the 10, in that 10 liter, in that 10 liter drink, I just pound it put inside the drinker and I and I add there the water and then um, how many times do we give this garlic to our birds well uh, you can decide as I told you that uh, we have quite a number of these medicinal plants that we are we, we are supposed to give our birds so it is you to decide if you're going to give if you're going to be using garlic you can decide that every week I can give three times a week okay depending on how you can afford it because one thing you must know garlic is also expensive so you can say that i'm going to give it three times a week then you can just choose those days every week you can give them like that or you can say i will give in two weeks i'll give three times you just choose the way you you want it but if you're giving it don't skip days if you you're giving this week give for the three days or for the four days or for the five days without stopping okay and one thing you must know is that let us start using this medicinal plant early before our birds getting before our birds getting sick let us try to vaccinate the birds as it is needed let us try to or uh, to let us try to maintain biosecurity so that our birds do not get all this kind of diseases so for today that is what i felt like i should share with you and if you find this video useful please Consider subscribing to the YouTube channel, click on the notification bell so that you never miss out any upload. Share this video, comment in the comment section down below. Tell me which country you're watching me from and I'll be smiling. See you next time. Bye-bye.